gonna be showing you our accommodation here in Tideline Ocean Resort and Spa here in Palm Beach, Florida. So, um, yes, so we are upgraded into a suite room, into a suite room, and then um, they only have two suite rooms here in the entire resort. So, come on in and let's see what we got here. Okay, so, yeah, so I'm gonna invert this camera. Okay. Okay, so right from the start, we are in the entrance, in the main, the main door. Okay, so what we have here is they have cabinets. This is what we have in their suite. So they have a cabinet, cabinet, and they have sink, and then they have another storage and the mini fridge. Um, but they don't have a, what is, coffee maker. Yeah, they don't have that. I don't know why. Maybe it's because of COVID, maybe. So yeah, so they have, what they have here is they have the lampstand and a 55-inch TV. Yes, and they have storage, another storage there. And then they have two full-size sofa and co coffee table. As in a head to toe mirror, and that is what we have here the nice view. It's a very nice view here, guys. I wish you were here so you can ah, see. Oh, ah, it's a nice view. The trees, the trees, excuse me, guys. Excuse me, excuse me, guys. Oh, so yeah. So see how nice it's nice, how nice it's here. So nice. It's packed actually because um, it's Valentine's last night. It's Valentine's Day. So yeah, it's kind of they're fully booked actually. They don't have vacant room. That's what they said yesterday. It's not what the apprentice said. So yeah, it's really nice. I wish that you were here. You know, you can smell the breeze and uh, feel the breeze. So yeah, they have like, I don't know what's that, a chair, a comfy chair, coffee table. So yeah, they have. And then the other the other side, um, that's the um, balcony of our, the room, of our room. So um, let's get back here. Let's get back inside. Okay, let's get back inside. So let's get back inside. Okay. Okay. And then, actually, we can pass here. We can also pass there. Pass on that side. But okay, I will just pass here to get into the bedroom. Okay, so they have another storage. And I already put our stuff here last night. And then they have safe. They have safe. Yeah, that's good. Well, everybody hotel has a safe, right? Not a new thing. Yeah. Everybody has a safe. Okay. So yeah, we have the bathroom. A pretty bathroom. I like it. Okay, so. We have the shower area and then they have this um, the stonework of the shower area is the same floor for the entire room it's the same and it's kind of like I don't know what kind of color is it? it's kind of brown and dark but not a thing for me not my color of choice but it's nice yeah it's neat okay so that's the shower area and next to it is the uh, king and queen's throne. Ta-da! Good thing nobody is here. Because my husband is on the bed. And it's a frosted door. And then next is we have here the vanity sink. His and her sink. And I already put my stuff there yesterday. A lot of trash already also. 
And yeah, this is our sink. Oh, sorry for the background. That's my husband lying down, lying, lying in the bed, resting. Okay, so yeah, quite nice. I like it. Okay, it's easy to clean. It's easy to clean. You know the, the, the top, the countertop. The yes, and then they have a. For me, it's big, big bath. Um, it's big for me because I'm a um, small, small woman, fitted. So, yeah, this is huge for me, huge. Like, look at me. So, yeah, that's huge bathtub for me. It's nice. It's nice. It's spacious, actually, inside here. Yeah, so, and that's it. That's it for the bathroom. That's it for the bathroom. Okay, so we're gonna be heading now to the room. That's my lovely husband lying down, searching for something. I don't know what he's searching. What are you searching, love? Costa Rica. Oh, he's searching for Costa Rica. I'm sure. Okay, so we have a bedside table big big lamp shade and yeah king size bed king size bed and i don't know what's that net that's a design hmm, i don't know that design thing i don't like it much the color though it's much then they have this um working area here if you're like working like you know your laptop chair so yeah you can put your stuff there they have a I don't, maybe 55 inches TV, I assume. Not sure. Okay, so we have here. Okay, I will explain this to you guys. This this is the blind of, you know, I think the entire hotel, yes, because we already went here last November, and then the, whole, the, the room that we got also is the same, the same blinds that they're having. So actually, I, I kind of don't like it because when we, when we wake up this morning, um it's kind of like you know when you're tired from your flight it's kind of like gleaming we, we wake up to it it's already like yeah, we wake up late and then it's it's really gleaming you know it's not the typical dark blinds that you always that you always get from other hotels so it's not like that but i hope that they have this kind of not like this because it's really like you know the, the light it really how to say it gets on so when you wake up in the morning so when you wake up late so you are it's like you know it's very gleaming so yeah i keep on <laughs> sorry guys keep on repeating stuff so another here another balcony we also have balcony from there from you know outside and the access from the living room now we also have access to the balcony from our bedroom so let's come out and see what's oh look at that look at that guys how lovely it is how gorgeous it is to be here right do you agree with it yes it is no need to ask because it really is gorgeous right so yeah there are those people kiteboarding yes yeah it's really nice the wind like you see the waves it's kind of big waves if you're out there and it's packed guys it's really packed because yeah like what i told you earlier yesterday was a valentine's day so you know people really like to stay yards and like what the front desk person said they're fully booked like they don't have a vacant room it's, it's a good business they're having a good business <laughs> so yeah guys so oh look at the view so, look at the view look at people they're enjoying lounging you know in the sun sun bathing so yeah i wish you were here guys i cannot describe how how beautiful it is you know to feel you know just the breeze you know the breeze that will uh, make that will you know will touch your face and then blow your hair it's really nice so relaxing it's just it's just relaxing it's gorgeous yeah 
So, yeah, you can just like lounge in here. Yeah, and then see this like ocean, 100 like full ocean view. Full ocean view. We're just so lucky that, you know, we're upgraded in a suite and then got this ocean front view. Okay, so look at that. Look down. So they have those. Um, that's the I don't know. Is it? I don't know if it's a patio dining. I don't know how you call that. So patio dining of the of the resort, the restaurant outside dining of the restaurant. Then they have this. It's really nice to you know hang out there, guys. The casita. It's really relaxing. Then you just you just hang out there. Oh, there's some drinks. Yeah, it's really nice. Oh, guys, it's so gorgeous. I can't contain myself. <laughs> oh my gosh. But, yeah. I think it's it's perfect time to go down there now. Because it's not that warm anymore. So, you know, the sun is not like scorching. It's not scorching hot anymore like earlier. So, yes. I think I should be going down there now. Yeah. So for now guys, um, thank you for watching this video, hope you like it and see you soon, bye guys, bye guys. So yes guys, that's all about um, our accommodation here, um, our room, um, here in Ocean, um, in Tideline Ocean Resort and Spa. Yeah, as you notice, guys, earlier during the week, earlier, um, I sneeze four times. So yeah, I kind of paranoid and that because you know, um, during our flight, um, during our flight yesterday, um, the plane was packed. Yeah, actually, and and you know, the plane is, you know, it's not. We're not economy, <laughs> so we're next to each other. We're not spacing, so kind of worried, worried about that. You know, it's COVID, and you know the virus is still uh, around. Yeah, and also earlier when we when we were out down there in the in the outside restaurant, there was a lady. Uh, they were drinking wine and the lady <laughs> kept on sneezing and didn't even like um cover her face like when she sneezed i mean come on it's covid you should be responsible enough or you should be conscientious enough that when you sneeze you cover you no know, you cover especially if there's you know people around you even though you're like yeah six feet distance but even though you're in six feet distance, you should still cover your um, face when you when you when you cough or when you sneeze. It's, it's disgusting. It's really disgusting. So yeah, I hope I don't have COVID. I'm just paranoid. I'm paranoid. So yeah. having a great time here like I mean it's been a it's been a while since I haven't I haven't traveled so the last time we traveled was like I think 10 months wait was it eight months ago now from now back in the Philippines so it's kind of it's kind of like you know um, good good feeling that we're able to travel now because you know they already eased down the travel restrictions, even the even the dining. Like back in LA, they close. Um, they have an order that you know close all the dining, so you can only um, have a take takeaway foods order and you know curbside pickup. You cannot really dine outside, but at least now they already bring back the already allow to operate patchy dining 
but I was surprised here in Florida. When we got in Florida, they have inside and outside dining. But it's good to see though that you know people are you know it's alive. You know it's nice to see that it's really quite you know depressing if you have if you're being restricted. Not, you cannot do this. You cannot do that. Yeah, but at least you know, just be responsible. Like yeah, like like that. If you was me, you just have to cover your face for that sake. Yeah, yeah. You should be conscientious enough, and you know, keep your keep yourself distance away, and always wear mask. Do not touch your face. Always have a sanitizer in your hand, like you know, handy. So when you need it, you can just have it anytime if you need it. So yeah. Well, that's what we are having. We have, we always have um, sanitizer in my pocket. So if I don't have a bag, I just have it in my pocket. So yeah. So you know, those are just, just the simple things that you can do to, you know, protect yourself. And even not, even if you have it, like, not to to give it to other people. So yeah. So yeah, guys, just sharing my thoughts about it. So, thank you guys for watching and hope to see you soon in my next video. Bye guys!